Oh, hey, whose truck is that? Oh, that's mine. What's up, guys? Fort Wayne Vlogger here. I'm just making a little ride through my neighborhood this afternoon. I really didn't do a whole lot this morning other than do some laundry dishes, you know, the boring stuff. But uh, isn't this beautiful? All these trees around here. All the leaves that have fallen. Oh, it's wonderful. So the election is just days away now. And I actually just read that uh, Gary Johnson is on the ballot in all 50 states. So just putting that out there. I don't want to tell you directly who I'm voting for because, you know, I just don't put my opinion out there like that. <laughs> Man, the sun is bright. No, in all seriousness, I try to stay out of politics as much as possible, but I will take responsibility and go vote. So that is very important. I bet you the turnout is going to be amazing this year for voting just because it's so con controversial. So go vote if you're registered to vote. This house right here on the corner just sold for over half a million dollars at an auction. It's pretty big and pretty nice inside. It's a little more chilly than it has been the past couple days this week, but uh, still decked out in shorts and uh, t-shirt here. Got my Comets gear on because there's a Comets game tonight that I'm working. So that's going to be some fun playing against the Indy Fuel hockey team which I don't imagine we'll have any time any any tough any any complications in beating that's what I'm trying to say I'm still hyped up after after the last home game we had last week against the Allen Americans from Texas how we whooped their ass <laughs> quite literally of course there's like within the first period there were like three major fights one of them was really good uh, one of the players Sidlowski that was pretty epic. I got some good footage of that on my camera, on my, at work, you know. The camera at work, unfortunately, dude, that'd be epic to have it for vlog footage, but couldn't have, can't really work two cameras at once. So that's Sweeney Park back there, and then there's like a little cutout to come in near the river, and there's a disc golf hole right here. And it's like right next to the river. I don't think that's very safe for your frisbee. <laughs> I bet you at the bottom of this river here there's a dozen discs just just sitting down there. Can't really see through the uh, brown disgusting Fort Wayne River water. I wish you could. Still haven't been kayaking on these rivers which I still want to do which this would probably be the opportune time since all these leaves look and the trees look awesome. So maybe doing that soon. I don't know. I said I would go. And I really want to, honestly. Okay, I think this is actually where this hole starts. Where that ending spot was. Hole 14, yep. So, you better have a straight shot when throwing it down that way. Otherwise, it's going in the river. Over here, unlike the other side of Sweeney, this is really cool. It says, welcome to Fort Wayne. If only my drone was working properly, but it's really not a reliable drone at all. The new one by DJI that just came out, the Mavic, which is like only, it could basically fit in your pocket, looks really awesome. The problem with that, like most others, is that it's uh, pretty expensive. It's a thousand dollars, so I don't have a thousand dollars laying around, unfortunately. <laughs> Echo! Justin's sister. You guys probably see me in the videos prior, but I uh, got my my doggy with me today, and we are headed to the Bicentennial Woods, which is just about five minutes from where I live, north uh, Coldwater Road. So everyone, I want you to meet Molly. She is a Jack Russell slash Parsian mix, and I believe. 
believe she's about nine years old now. So we're spending the last hour of daylight pretty much adventuring here through Bicentennial Woods with a little puppy. Actually, oh, I heard, oh, what was it recently that I heard? It's not, it's a pup, it's not a puppy, it's, it's a dog. A forever puppy, that's what it's called. Yeah, she is a forever. <laughs> a forever puppy. All right, this is gonna be a skillful attempt. Take the dog across the log. Can you do it? Can you do it? Let's go. You go first, Molly. You can do it. You can do it. Keep going. What? Circus dog. Hashtag circus dog. <laughs> Oh my god, it's a wild Pokemon, it's coming towards us! Capture it! Did you bring your Pokeballs? <laughs> uh, oh, the leash. Uh, yeah, well, I guess I could be considered a Pokeball. Throw the Pokeball, it's running away! Alright, let's stop, see what she does. She stopped. Oh. She's like, no. Alright, right, let's keep moving. What, the path ends? Oh, she's like, are you still there? This makes me really want a dog now. I've always wanted a dog, but I'm just not home a, I'm just not home a lot, so it just wouldn't work out. I wouldn't, I feel bad for the dog, so. I'm not gonna get one unless I know I can take care of it the right way. Huh? She responds well to a whistle. Yeah. We're gonna try to get her to walk across this big tree right here. Let me get her. Come on, over here. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> she's like, which way? No, no, don't jump, don't jump. No. <laughs> Just keep going. Come go on. This way. Ooh, go down that log. Go that way. Go down this little one. Go, go that way. Come down this way. Molly, right here. Right here, come down this one. Come on. Molly, right here. Come on. Molly. Hey, Molly, Molly. Molly. She is not. And she jumped. <laughs> That's all right, she's strong. Molly, you're supposed to go down this one. Oh my God, I'm gonna get attacked. Here it comes. <laughs> Look at that sunset. It looks so pretty. Through the trees. Every day. What? The sun? Yeah. Every day. It sets every day. But people really don't take the time to look at its beauty. Oh. Yep, it's pretty beautiful right now. Yeah, for being about nine years old, this dog has some skills. It's got some moves. Well, that was a nice little adventure to uh, end this little evening. Again, this is just where we were. Bicentennial Woods, an Acres Land Trust. It's pretty far north off of uh, Shof Road. So, it's pretty cool, pretty cool little spot. Bye. Wanna go say bye? Bye, Molly. Woo! All right, now for the last task of the day. Heading over to the War Memorial Coliseum because I am working the comments game. Tonight I am on the robotic camera, which is like a 360 camera that's on the bottom of the Jumbotron, the four-sided Jumbotron that's in the center of the ice. So I'll be responsible for like shots for the different like cameras, like kiss cam and look-alikes and, and uh, like haircut cams. I don't know, just random stuff that we have. And I'm um, not sure what else, but uh, yeah, it'll be first night on that, so it'll be pretty cool. Hey, I'm an employee. Um, they told me to park here since they're working the game tonight. I guess I'll, I'll, I'll always get free parking at the Coliseum, as long as I'm an employee. 
So they're five dollars in my pocket. Yeah, that's what they charge. Five dollars to park a car. What the hell? So I found out another perk that I have is uh, I get free coffee from the Tim Horton stand. Can't beat that. 49 minutes and 10 seconds of game time. All right, here's the machine I'll be working on. This thing controls this cam. I can see everyone. All right, game's over. Comets won zero to four. Well, wait, four to zero. That's the way to say it. That's pretty awesome working the uh, the robo cam. I got some good good kiss cam footage. That was pretty cool. And uh, there's this one oblivious guy we have this oblivious cam like if they're like texting or something they're not even paying attention we keep the camera on them until they pay attention um so that's pretty cool i had a fun time with that i'll be doing that again next game so yeah that's gonna be it for today i'm gonna go home edit the vlog and then i got a uh, weekend ahead of me that it's gonna be hopefully fun i don't know we'll see so thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time all right